In this video, I'm going to teach you a simple single strategy you can use to dominate more points with your forehand, and it's called Rectangle Square. Now, this is high-level college singles, Stanford versus UCLA. Big serve down the tee, weak return, net, uh, the uh, server moves around this ball and crushes it inside out. Now, when you play singles, and by the way, you should be filming yourself all the time and reviewing the footage. If you're serious about your tennis and improving, then you've got to film yourself and review the footage, compare it to what you're learning in these videos on YouTube. The court is not cut into two halves. That's not how you want to think of it. But rather, you want to think of rectangle and square. The rectangle is forehands. The square is backhands. What I mean by this is you want a bigger area of the court where you're going to hit forehands and a smaller area of the court where you're going to hit backhands. Here we've got a big serve. And look initially where this return is coming. In fact, what I want to do is put a little dot where this ball lands. Now, we don't actually see where the ball lands exactly, but we have an idea based on the shadow. So basically, the ball is landing right there. So let's put a little dot. That's where the ball is landing, right in that yellow dot. Since the ball is landing in that yellow dot, we can actually see that this ball off the return is actually coming to the server's backhand but he is not accepting this as a backhand. And the reason is because he has the idea of rectangle and square. And if the ball is anywhere in this green area or coming into that green area, he's going to move around it and make it a forehand. Let me ask you, and when a ball comes to your backhand and it's weak, are you moving around it to hit a bigger and better shot with your strength? You should be because the server moves around this ball and now he is able, he could do anything. He could crush it inside in. He could go inside out. He chooses inside out. One thing I want you to notice is he doesn't just sit on his laurels and say, oh, I got this and hit it into the open court. Watch what he does. Watch how he immediately moves forward right after he hits the shot. Watch, he moves around it. He hits and he quickly moves forward just in case the returner had guessed correctly to the direction that the server was hitting and the ball came back over, he, the server wanted to come over and volley that ball. So you've got to start making this move, this move of a weak ball coming to your backhand, and you move around it. Now, let's look how it's done. First off, you want to think of a semicircle. You move around this ball. So here he's in the blue, and he's actually moving around. He's trying to give himself space. He's also trying to make sure that when he's hitting this ball, he has his body weight going forward, not so much for the power, but just to make sure he's not going off the court and has his, his body weight moving off the court. He kind of wants to come around it, so he's going more forward as he hits this shot, so it's easier for him to then go in after he hits this ball. But please, go out and film yourself. When the ball comes very softly to your backhand, do not accept it. Move around it. Be able to dominate with your forehand. You're going to win a lot more matches. Now, if you'd love to use the same strategies the pros use to win their matches, then you got to pick up the Singles Playbook by Fuzzy Yellow Balls. It's all broken down by the type of opponent you play against, and it's over 50 pages, strategy after strategy, and what's really cool is each page comes with a QR code, so you can watch a video of exactly how to use each strategy. Just use my link in the description and pinned in the first comment. And if you're looking for people in your local area to play matches against or practice with, or if you want to find a coach who's close to you who can help you with your game, then use my link in the description and pinned in the first comment, playercourt.com slash two minute tennis. When you use my link to sign up, you get 50% off. Simply stated, if a weak ball comes to your backhand, move around it and dominate the point with your forehand. You do this, there's no doubt. You're going to gain confidence, win more matches and play much better tennis. This is Ryan Reedy from two minute tennis.net. You got this.